Assalamu alaikum. Today, the chapter I'm going to explain you is Understanding of our bodies. Human body is a wonderful machine. Human body works like a machine. It performs several functions without rest from the birth. Our body continues to work without stopping for a second. It doesn't stop even for a second. The main organs of the human body are lungs, heart, kidney, liver, and brain. Cell is the structural and functional unit of the body. It means that our body is composed of cells. Forget about lungs, forget about heart, forget about brain. Just focus on this point that without cells, our body will not be able to perform any function. For example, when we eat, it is not the stomach that gives us energy, but cells absorb all the nutrients and then provide energy to the whole body. So in conclu conclusions, we can say that cell is the most important part of our body. Cell is the structural and functional unit of the body. The body has more than 50,000 living cells of 200 different types. The hormones and enzymes, various types of cell perform different functions. Cells doing similar job are grouped to form tissues. The tissues group together in a special manner to form organs. Now let's see that how cells group to form tissues and how tissues group to form an organ. Levels of organization. Look at the diagram. A small cell, a small atom combines together to form a molecule. Then different molecules combine to, uh, to form a cell. Now different cells combined, two and more cells combines to form a tissue. Then different tissues combine to form an organ. As you can see, different tissues combine to form a stomach. Then this uh, organ, different organs combine to form a organization. As you can see, this is the whole digestive system. How it is made? It started from a cell. Different cells combines, they form a tissue. Then different tissues combine, they form an organ. And then different organs combine to form an organ system. And this system, this is a digestive system. It has a liver, it has a stomach, small intestine, and large intestine. And it started from a cell, a very tiny thing cell. Now what are the major organ systems in our human body? First is nervous system. It consists of the brain, spinal cord, and nerves. It controls all functions of our body. Nervous system controls our whole, our whole body system. It works like a CPU of a computer. It, is consist, it consists of a brain, spinal cord, and nerves. The muscular system, it consists of muscles. It controls movement of all parts of the body. Muscular system is responsible for the, controlling the movement of our body. The skeleton system, it consists of bones. It gives our body its shape. It also gives strength to our body and protect the soft organs. Now, what is the difference between a skeletal system and a muscular system? Skeletal system sub gives support to our body. It gives strength to our body. And it protects different organs. Like, for example, a rib cage protects our lungs. And the muscular system controls the movements. It helps in the movement of the body. And skeletal system gives us gives strength to the body. The circulatory system, it consists of heart, blood vessels, and blood. Blood vessels consist of arteries and veins 